is so warm today. Oh my goodness. Should we check the temperature? What is the temperature right now? It's about 28 degrees outside. Hey guys, it's Alice again. So today I am joining you with a haul. I feel like it's been quite a while since I did a haul, but today, as you can see from the title, I have shopped all in the tall section of the Misguided website. I actually already own the Misguided skinny jeans. I will leave them linked in the top part of my description because I absolutely love them. So I've got high hopes for this haul. Fingers crossed it's good. And just bear in mind, the temperature right now means I've had to leave my windows open. So if you hear like dogs barking and birds chirping, just gonna have to deal because I've been filming for a solid minute and I'm already sweating so I apologize so I tried to get a selection of different items from each kind of category so I've got trousers I obviously already have the jeans a top a dress skirts shorts I think I've got a mixture and um, again I'll link everything down below but this first thing I picked up is super simple it's just a kind of thin jumper material long sleeved bodycon dress and I know it's super simple it's nothing special but I thought this with like a denim jacket over the top or just as like a little casual evening dinner outfit like maybe put some bright colored accessories with it I thought this could look really really cute and obviously because I am five foot eight I am quite tall a lot of bodycon dresses are too short and my butt starts to come out the bottom so hopefully this one solves the problem I really like this dress I feel like it's not going to ride up too much at all as you can see the arms are long enough I think this would be super nice as like when it's a bit colder maybe a pair of heels and a nice bag of like, I'd probably wear like a red bag or a mustard coloured bag. You could dress it up or like I said, dress it down with like a denim jacket. Yeah, I really like this. The fabric's nice. It's fitting me nice. It's kind of hugging in all the right places. Yeah, I like this one. Okay, so this is my Marmite item of the haul this is going to be a love or hate thing i think i showed my mum she was a hate i'm a bit of a i don't know but it is this so i obviously wanted to try something from the skirt section and this was what what i picked um it's like a snake skin obviously fake with crisscrossy details on and little bows on the bottom I like the pattern a lot, like pair this with a black top and some black heels and like a fluffy handbag or something. I think this would look really nice, but it's the fact that it's actually like a faux leather. It looks a bit weird. I feel like I could stand on a street corner wearing this maybe. Like if I had this on with the wrong outfit, like with some knee high boots, I'd definitely be giving off them vibes. But yeah, I feel like this could work. I mainly bought it to see what the length was like. Um, I got a size 12, I think, in everything. Did I? Let's have a look. Yes, UK 12. So, yeah, let's see. Let's see what this one looks like. Okay, I'm going to be quick with this one because I am boiling and this is very, very tight. But, yeah, this is too small for me. I would most definitely split it if I sat down. Although, I think it does look nice. If you're into this kind of style, I think you could make it work with a nice little pair of heels and a bag. I've just got this kind of wrap over bodysuit on from ASOS. Um, yeah, I like the idea of it. It's definitely a bit too small for me, even though it's a 12. So size up if you are thinking of getting it. These little elastic -y bits, this bit of string is elastic. So it has a bit of give in it, but I literally can't, I don't think I could walk really like <laughs> I don't know it is a nice skirt and I think paired right and in the right size could look beaut but never said beaut in my life but I can't breathe <laughs> this is a dress that would be perfect for this kind of weather so this is a simple little white off the shoulder dress with three quarter length sleeves and then it's just got a kind of gathered waist and then it goes all the way down to a little frill at the bottom. I thought this was just super simple. I think it is slightly see-through, so we'll see on the cutaway whether you can see my black underwear, but I thought this was super nice. I'm presuming I've got a size 12 again. Yes, I did. I'll leave the price on screen, but this feels such nice quality. And I forgot to mention, I actually got 30% student discount because they had a a deal going on so it knocked like 60 quid off the basket when I went to check out so yeah okay as you can see I know I'm wearing black underwear 
but this is so see-through I feel like you can even see my belly button through this like I don't know if nude underwear would even save it maybe it would but I mean style wise it's beautiful if you're wearing the right, right underwear I don't think you can see my bra obviously apart from the bra straps in terms of how it fits fits lovely the sleeves are hitting exactly where I need them to it doesn't feel too tight around my shoulders it's got like a little keyhole detail there and then this little waistband fits really well it's pretty but literally look at that obviously I'm not in the right underwear for this will I keep it I'm not sure I think with a pair of sandals and a cute little straw bag and a little hat could be a winner I mean it's long enough which is the main point of this yeah I'm gonna try this on with a different pair of underwear but I mean at least you can gauge how see-through it is right so I headed to the bodysuit section and there were a few bodysuits that look quite similar to ones I already had so I just didn't pick anything like that up because I would like to keep it if I like it so I went for a white bodysuit I think it's more cream than white actually now I'm, I'm looking at it and it's got like a sweetheart off the shoulder neckline so I think it kind of sits around here obviously it's from the tall section and then it's got a little cinched in waist and then I presume a thong bodysuit at the bottom and it does have the poppers so fingers crossed that the tall part of the bodysuit fits me because I do have quite a long torso and I usually end up with like the world's worst wedgie if I don't actually um buy things from the tall section so yeah let's see what this one looks like I don't rate this bodysuit okay ignore the way I have paired this because it looks a bit weird but I don't like the bodysuit and I was really hoping I would. It is definitely a thong bodysuit but even though it's a tall and it's a size 12 it's super snug. I enjoy like the idea of it like this I think it's really flattering obviously without the bra straps um, but the practicality of it I feel so restricted and I'm much more of a girl that would rather be comfortable than look nice you know like comfort is the most important thing for me but yeah it just feels too tight like this is no there is no room for breathing in this maybe if I got a bigger size but I don't know if I like the style enough to even bother this one is going to be so hard to show on camera I don't even know which way round it is but hopefully the cutaway will make sense so this is a jumpsuit so again I was trying to get things from all the sections and I really really liked this it's quite out of my comfort zone it's a color I wouldn't usually choose as you can see it's a blue print like paisley print long flared sleeves look at that sleeve oh yeah and it's kind of chiffon and then it goes down it's got a little like play suit bit underneath and then the legs have like slits in the front it just looked so beautiful on the website. My mum loved this when I showed her it the other day. So again, we're gonna see if this is long enough for me, what it fits like, and it just feels absolutely beautiful. And with the 30% off discount, I don't even think this was that expensive for how gorgeous this is. Imagine wearing this on holiday. So beautiful. Even though I don't have a holiday booked, which is quite sad. Okay, so let's picture this with some heels on. I do like it I think it's just that little bit too extra for me I feel like I could be in the cast of Greece or like Mamma Mia that's probably better <laughs> I feel like I could be in the new Mamma Mia film wearing this like woo -hoo. but the concept I think is really cool if you're brave enough to wear something like this go for it it is like super open so you could either kind of pin it or wear like nipple covers or like just one of those kind of little sticky bra things but I could definitely not wear this one because you can see it but other than that yeah I like it the sleeves are huge the only thing is it is giving me a front and a back wedgie and it's from the tall section and I haven't actually zipped it up all the way I don't think I have anyway but it's a bit tight and I am about to get a wedgie I've definitely got camel toe but <laughs> yeah I think this is beautiful and for the right occasion and the right person definitely but if you're any taller than like five five it's probably not gonna fit you but other than that yeah it's amazing like the legs are long enough they're probably a little bit too long actually but I think this is so cute like I'm just not not daring enough to wear this <laughs> right got myself some shorts I think every single summer I change sizes in shorts I either lose weight or gain weight or 
I just always never have a pair of shorts so I picked up these these are actually the only things in this haul that I picked up in a size 10 because I have size 10 misguided jeans and they fit lovely so I was presuming that these ones will fit although these don't have any stretch to them so just bear that in mind we'll see what they fit like when I've got them on but they're obviously a little bit distressed they are quite short like super short shorts which I'm not sure I will be 100% comfortable with we will see but yeah it just feels like a nice sturdy denim again not really much stretch so I don't know how comfortable they'll be but just a standard short you know these shorts oh my goodness these are not comfortable in the slightest I got them fastened but I don't really think I could sit down um I don't know they just feel really little they're definitely not the same material that the jeans that I have from misguided are in the denim is a lot more rigid and like I said when I held them up not as stretchy I've got them on and they're not really covering my bum I feel like I can't move my legs very much definitely size up so I got a 10 which is what I usually am in misguided trousers and stuff but obviously in this case with these particular pair of shorts think about getting the next size up I feel like these could be nice but even then I think they're just a bit too short for my liking I don't know I don't think I'm a shorts kind of girl I just can't I can't get a pair that fits right and like there's a bit of a gappy thing here like oh next item is a play suit so i actually was looking so hard for a tall play suit and the one that i liked wasn't in stock they didn't have the greatest selection of play suits in the tall section which is quite upsetting because that's one of the things that's obviously going to be quite snug if you're tall but i did find this this is not something i would usually wear i don't know how comfortable i'll feel in this but i thought for the purpose of the video i'll order it i can always send it back it's a like black and white striped v-neck skinny strapped play suit and it's a skirt so at the front it looks like an asymmetric skirt and then at the back it's obviously shorts so i mainly picked this up just to see if it's going to be long enough because obviously that's the point in this video um it feels really good quality it's got a bit of a stretch to it so it should be comfortable we'll uh, we'll give it a go the only thing i've just noticed is that it doesn't have adjustable straps so that could prove a bit of an issue you know what i like this more than i thought i would it fits really nice i'm not 100 sure on the style for me but it's beautiful i really like how they've designed it they've, it does have like weird extra nipple bits though but yeah the only thing i'd say is that the v-neck part is quite low like this could slip down quite easily so it would have been nice to have adjustable straps but i mean it's easy enough to kind of fix that yourself with a bit of sewing or like me get your mum to do it um but yeah the skirt bit looks nice i think maybe with like a little blazer over the top for like a night out it feels a little bit more secure than wearing a dress this short um but yeah i don't have a wedgie always a bonus i think this looks really nice and the material again is lovely i definitely rate the material that misguided use i think it's gorgeous <laughs> this is actually really similar to what i have on right now but this is a cropped white top with long sleeves and the little like is this called like a handkerchief hem like when it's a little bit frilly i thought let's see how the crop tops fit like if they are too short too long like just kind of how they fit the material of this is such good quality like it's not thick but it's also that kind of material that i don't think you'd be able to see your bra through it i mean we'll give it a go but yeah again a size 12 nice simple piece would look nice with the shorts or i don't know some pair, a pair of high-waisted jeans all right i really like this i think this looks super flattering it's cutting off like just under my ribs so it fits perfect and the sleeves are plenty long enough which obviously is quite rare when you're quite tall but obviously misguided have the tall section down not sure about it with this outfit maybe this is just a bit of a weird pairing but these trousers are from primark by the way yeah i i like this <laughs> okay this is definitely not something for this kind of 28 degree weather but i really like this i definitely don't need any more jumpers but it's a red jumper and surprise surprise it's cropped so it's got kind of like a rough looking hemline at the bottom and then it's got a black stripe down the sleeve and then black 
tie things I just thought this was super nice and simple you can chuck it on and it doesn't kind of bury you because it is cropped um, and a lot of cropped things like I said are too short for me because I am so tall so yeah I am not going to enjoy trying this on in the cutaway but let's see what it looks like <laughs> wearing the jumper what's happened here have they forgot to chop these off like what is this is this a fashion statement or an error I don't know but it fits it feels lovely like you'd expect a jumper to feel it's not scratchy it's long enough I just don't understand why it's got flappy bits and finally again not something really for this kind of weather but when it gets a little bit colder in the evenings I got a kind of is this like a biker jacket a bomber jacket I don't know um, and it's a mustard colour it's very stretchy like the material surprised me when I picked it up it's really really good quality I do remember it being a little bit more pricey than the other things but it's a jacket so that kind of makes sense and I mainly got this because these jackets always look super weird on me. I don't know why, but maybe it is something to do with the length and the fact that they're made for like smaller bodied people. So hopefully this will look nice. But yeah, really, really good quality fabric. Feels, it feels expensive. It feels lovely. So yeah, got zips and kind of silver hardware. Very happy with this one. I was almost kind of hoping that I wouldn't like this jacket because obviously it's going to save me money if I don't, but... I really like this it fits quite nice it is quite like tight fitting around my arms but because it's so stretchy like it doesn't restrict you at all um but yeah just as like a little throw on over an evening outfit I think it's gorgeous and it cuts off at such a nice point yeah I really like this what do you guys think about this one definitely recommend it feels amazing oh oh my gosh i've never been that level of warm whilst filming a video but i think overall it's been a semi successful i'd say i'd be keeping at least at least a third if not a half of the things i chose let me know which ones were your favorite and also let me know if there's any other places that you would like me to do a clothing haul from hopefully it won't be as warm as this when i film the next one but yeah let me know if you would like to see any more i hope you enjoyed this video if you did you know what to do give it a thumbs up and i'll see you on wednesday for a super exciting video bye